I've been thinking this through, especially with regard to what happened during the COVID lockdown. You know, and if there's an emergency, you can understand that you can understand the argument that some civil liberties might have to be lifted to deal with the emergency. You can understand that argument in principle. But my sense is that if someone is calling for an emergency, claiming an emergency, and simultaneously pointing to the fact that civil liberties are to be suspended in consequence, the first conclusion you should draw from that is that they're probably wolves in sheep's clothing. They're probably tyrants. And that the argument is actually the reverse. They want to impose control, and so they're generating an emergency. And we should demand, what do they say, radical claims require um, overwhelming evidence. It's something like that. And so our general sense as citizens should be, if your bloody emergency, if you're calling for an emergency that grants you additional power, you would have to prove every which way that you're not just a tyrant who's lying. That should be the default thumb, you know, the r rule of thumb. And so the same thing seems to me to apply with these, with these CCTVs and, and this widespread surveillance.